and like hold myself accountable for what's going into there. Dream team, stick together and make history. Golden Wonderland. Hi, my name is Eden. Welcome back to my channel, or welcome if you're new here. I am Eden. I'm on a wellness journey, holistic wellness. I don't really follow any specific type of diet. I just like to make really good food. Nothing's too strict. No foods are like off the table, nothing too restrictive. I do follow WW to track what I eat and like hold myself accountable for what's going into there. So I'm gonna show you what I eat today. You'll hear me referencing points a lot if you're not on WW and I get 34 points per day. I have actually already had my beauty water, well it's a tea. I've had my beauty tea this morning. I'll put in some clips of what that looks like. You can go to my last vlog if you wanna know how I make that. And I also already had my coffee, I know. I was up before the sun. I wanted this video to have good lighting, <laughs> sorry. I used two of the Pete's pods. Um, they're the 11 intensity espresso pods and I also ended up using one cup of almond milk with my Tarani zero sugar caramel syrup. I'll show you that. This is what the syrup looks like. So I put like five pumps of this, a cup of almond milk, and then two shots. And that makes my coffee one point. I'm getting ready to make an omelet. I'm gonna use two eggs, some applewood smoked goat cheese that I got from my local co-op, some spinach from Organic Girl. Oh, it's open, one just fell on the ground. And I got this at my local co-op, but it's actually a product of Colorado. So it's just an applewood smoked goat cheese. This is the brand, if you're curious, I'm gonna use two points worth of this. I decided to add some of these hot, hot, crispy habanero peppers in olive oil. I don't count these as points because the olive oil is all at the bottom and the top ones barely have any oil on them. Um, and then here is my omelet. She's not a looker, but she is gonna be yummy. I used two eggs. Does anyone remember that movie with LL Cool J in it and like a boat is sinking and then he's like, before I die, I have to show you guys how to make an omelet. An omelet is two eggs, not three. Does anyone remember that scene or just me? Am I the only person who thinks of that when they see an omelet? Anyhow, this is two points from my goat cheese and then if you add in the one point for my coffee that I had earlier, I'm sitting at a three point breakfast. I'm making my dressing for lunch. It's a bunch of cilantro, about a bunch, it's like half a bunch. Um, but a bunch like a lot. <laughs> Four tablespoons of vinegar. I just use the vinegar from my pickled jalapenos. Two tablespoons of high quality olive oil so that it tastes good. Some salt and some of those crispy habaneros. I'm gonna go through this with the immersion blender and get it all liquidy and let it refrigerate for a little bit so that it, you know, gets all yummy. You know when stuff sits for longer, it gets yummier. I have some power greens and some cucumber. I'm gonna add half a cup of rice to my greens and greens bowl. And I seasoned my shrimp with this new Trader Joe's Cuban style citrusy garlic seasoning blend. That's a mouthful. So we have our rice, our dressing that we made, some bell peppers, cucumber, power greens, and some shrimp. And this is seven points all together, four points for the dressing because I used a tablespoon of oil for each serving and then um, three points for the rice. I'm gonna add some sriracha to mine. You can probably see it there, and it's gonna be pretty good. I use the Trader Joe's sriracha, and I don't use a lot. Last thing, I promise, I added some pepperoncini. I just wanted something like pickled and yummy in it, so there is my lunch. Most of you guys know I'm a popcorn girl. I usually have popcorn as a snack, but I've just been feeling chips and salsa lately. This is 15 chips, and that's five points. The pico de gallo is zero points, so it's a five point snack, and I have plenty of points to spare today, so it's a great choice. I wish I had some avocado, but I do not. My next snack of the day is one of these Too Good yogurts. They finally released a lemon, and I love it, and I like to crumble this lemon fiber one bar on top of it. This is two points, this is two points, so it's a four point snack, which brings me to nine points of snacks today. And it's gonna be so good, I love lemon. I'm like a lemon lover. This is how I do it, kind of like granola. I just kind of do it like granola. I just crumble it right on top. 
As you can see, it's starting to get dark. I'm getting ready to make some dinner. It's about six o'clock. I have some salmon. Oh, I forgot to start the air fryer. I'm getting ready to start the air fryer and I'll show you what else is going along with my dinner. This is the sauce that I'm using on my fish. I'm just gonna put a tablespoon kind of across my fish in my kale. It is a soy-free teriyaki sauce because I'm allergic to soy protein. I'm using these Trader Joe's Thai Shrimp Gyoza. I'm gonna have two of these with my dinner tonight. And I seasoned everything with the Trader Joe's Mushroom and Company Multi-Purpose Umami Seasoning Blend. And there we go. My salmon looks a weird color because that seasoning is brown, <laughs> the mushroom seasoning. So I just put the um, sauce on afterwards so that it doesn't all cook off in the air fryer. Put a little bit of extra on my kale and a little bit of furutake, that's zero points. These are four points, my sauce was two points, so this is a six point dinner. And it looks so good, I'm so hungry. You guys know I love my coffee and I have a lot of points left over, so I'm gonna use some of this Lily's Peppermint White Chocolate Style Bark. I have a third of a bar in here, which is four points, and I just put a couple of squirts of my Tirani sweetener in here. I like to break it up, because then it melts a little bit better. I'm gonna use two of the Starbucks decaf espresso. Their decafs are green. On the bottom, that's my almond milk. I'm gonna pour this extremely hot almond milk into here. One of my shots is done. Into the blender. And then a second shot. Put your lid on top. I'm using my Blendtec. I am a Blendtec partner. I have been for years. This isn't sponsored. You can get 20% off Blendtec blenders or accessories with code EDEN. It used to be 25, they made it 20, which is kind of a bummer, but it's still a pretty good discount code for these affiliate programs. And then I'm just gonna run it on green smoothie once. Make sure if you're ever blending anything hot, you use something like a towel or an oven mitt because it can get <laughs> explodey. And there is a vent in here, so the air can escape. Look at that yummy foam. There's still some more in here. Just a little bit. I overshot the almond milk by a tiny bit. But four points for my little nightcap. Just kidding, it's totally five points. I forgot to count the almond milk. Thank you guys for watching. I'm gonna go enjoy my latte with some real housewives. Please like, comment, and subscribe if you enjoyed the video. And I will see you guys really soon. Bye.